Hello everyone, I'm Ash Freeman and today we're moving through a 21 minute total body dumbbell workout. Now I did this one the other day and I have to say, I think it's gonna be my new go-to favorite. It is so quick, it is so effective. You guys are really gonna love it. I'll be using a five kilogram set of dumbbells today. Choose a weight that's going to challenge you. If you have a few sets, even better. Apart from that, all you'll need is a nice safe and flat space for your mat. And as always, remember that you know your body best. So take rest or modify however and whenever you need today. So take a minute, grab your water bottle, grab your towel, your props, whatever else you need, and take a deep breath. We'll get moving. There's a warm up in the description box below. Take that if you need. Otherwise, come to stand, grab your dumbbells. We are working 20 seconds on with 10 seconds rest, alternating between two exercises. Our first two exercises will be a goblet or a front squat. And then we take a rest and come into our lateral raise. So our legs get a break while we work upper body and vice versa. Squat first, feet hip distance apart, weights up in front, open your chest. Just use this first round almost like a warm up. But I really just want you to focus on staying tall and proud and pressing that mat away with your heels as you come to stand. Let's go three, two, one. Rest. Good job. Okay. Legs get a break. Let's go to upper body. Soften through the knees, open through the chest, drop those shoulders down. My core is active. Weights come up to shoulder height and lower. Keeping a nice soft bend through those elbows. Really starting to feel those delts, those shoulders working here. Good job. Control it, all right? Take your time. Rest, okay. I'm gonna be aiming for eight to 12 reps of this next round. Eight to 12 squats in the 20 seconds. Off we go. So now maybe starting to work a little bit faster. Starting to add some load with that speed. Good job, chest open, looking forward. Breathe, last two and one. Rest. Woohoo! Okay, legs get a break. Take a breath in, preparing for your lateral raises. Two, one, and go. 20 seconds here. Controlled and smooth. Good work. Total body workout today. And it's going to work the same each round. Each exercise will complement the other giving you that little break and rest that you need. We're up to the final round of our squats. So give it your best shot. Open your chest, shoulders down, breath in and go. All right, so I'm not gonna come fully to standing this time. I'm gonna stop just before to keep that load on. It's almost like a big pulse. So feel free to join me there. Oh my goodness. Woo -wee. Okay, we've got three, Two, one. Okay, standing up tall. Lateral raise, use this break. Grab a drink if you need. And let's go. Beautiful, strong arms. We are building here. Take your time and breathe. Good job, my friends. And this will be our first round done. Then we're moving on to our next two exercises. In two, and one, and rest. Okay, we're moving on to lunges and bicep curls. So you're at the top of your mat, open your chest, stand tall. We're gonna be alternating. So time has started now. Again, take the first round slow, find your balance. Feel into your energy, into your body today. Those arms are straight by the sides, they're not swinging, okay? Our elbows. A tuck neatly in next to our waist, into our ribs. Rest. Legs get a break. We're moving into bicep curls. So again, soften through the knees, open through your chest, in, down. Thumbs up towards your shoulders and down. Now that you're moving, just notice if you're kind of swinging, I want you to see if you can just use those arms. Three, two, one, rest. Woo! How are you going? All right, round two, 
Off we go back to our lunges. Big breath in, open the chest, and off we go. So, like I did with my final round of squats before, instead of coming fully to standing, I'm gonna keep my knees soft, keep that load on the legs, and just work as fast as I can through the lunge. Three, two, one, rest. This time I'm gonna put my wrists forward, curl wrists up to shoulders and extend, all right? Let's go, breathe. Good job. I really want you to have a weight here that is challenging you. This is certainly challenging me. And that's what we want, okay? We didn't come here for it to be easy. We came to get stronger. Rest. Final round of lunges. Woo! Oh my gosh. This is lit. Let's go. Three, two, one. Arms glued by your sides. Let's go final round. Let's rep it out. See how many you can get. But with control, with precision. Body connected. Core on. Let's go. Three, two, one, rest. Let's go back to thumbs to shoulders. Little difference, but it's good to do different variations. Off we go. Curl it in and down. Catch your breath here. We're going back to those legs and booty next. And some tricep work, okay? So getting all the different parts of our arms and upper body. Three, two, one, rest. You're gonna have just one heavy weight or maybe you wanna have two lighter weights, choice is yours. It's gonna hold down towards the ground, but back. We stay low, the time has started. You're stepping out with the right and out with the left. That glutes, those glutes, that booty is on the whole time, okay? Get it back, get it down. Open your chest. You've got three, two, one. Stand up, tricep extension. So, arms over the head. My biceps are glued in next to my head, okay? Bend just from the elbow and lift. Bend from the elbows and lift. Now soften your bottom ribs down. Draw your lower belly in. Soften through your knees. Keep the back of your neck long and in line with your spine. Two, one, rest. All right, so same thing. Open your chest. It stays proud. We come down, butt back. Okay, step out and in. Woo, yeah, off we go. Yes, guys, we are coming down onto the ground after this round. So working through those legs. Use two dumbbells if you can. Woo! Let's go, you've got three, two, one. Standing, get ready. If your weights are lighter, maybe instead you can do some extensions with both arms. Otherwise, if you've got a heavier weight joining me, time has started. Again, I want you to find that little tuck of the tail and tucking in through those bottom ribs. We're aiming for eight to 10 reps, extending and squeezing as the arms come straight. Good job, last one. Woo! All right, final round of our little pulse step outs. Let's get a low, 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 low. Low as you can go, three, two, one, and we're going. Lift off, big step out, little step in. Go, go, go. Woo, 10 more seconds. We're gonna get sweet relief to come down onto the mat soon. Three, two, one, and come to standing. Woo, okay, final round triceps. Again, if you've got lighter weights, you can do the extension. Otherwise, join me. Soften the shoulders. Let's go for two and three. Again, in that 20 seconds, we're aiming for eight to 12 reps, and we get through that three times. Neck in line with the spine. Three, two, one, 
straight down onto the mat. You've got 10 seconds. We're coming into bridges. Weights on top of the hip points to add that resistance. Lift, lower. Nice and simple. Grounding through those heels. Maybe lifting those toes if you can. Good job. So those weights are just adding that extra challenge here. Keep that tuck of the tail and the core on. You've got five, four, three, two, one. Sit up, legs out in front or wide. So whatever feels better in your body, your knees can be bent. We press, come back down. This is all through your shoulders and your core. Woo! Shoulders on fire. Keep your head stacked over your shoulders and your shoulders stacked over your hips. Keep going. Two, last one. Bring it in, come to lay on your back. All right, set up, heels in close to your body, hip distance apart, take a breath in and out. In, exhale to lift. Good job, my team. Now let's see if we can start to speed these ones up. Firing up through those glutes and the booty. Woo! Squeeze at the top. Good job, you got three. Two, last one, Woo, come back up. All right, if legs out or wide doesn't feel good, you can also sit cross-legged or kneeling, whichever is best in your body, you're maintaining that straight spine. Good job, arms straight up and over, straight back down. Try not to swing, staying nice and still. Breathe, good job, two, one, rest, final round, glute bridges, and then we're into some chest and back. I need a towel, oh my gosh. Three, two, one, lift, lower. Let's see how fast you can go now. In fact, let's stay up and pulse, and pulse, keep it up. Now watch your knees, that so they're not opening out to the side. They stay straight up to the sky. You've got three, I am with you, two, and one, Whew. lower it down, final round, shoulder press. I am sweating, two, one, Whew. let's go. Breathe, your legs, your booty is about to get a break, okay? So we're moving into chest and back next, sit tall here, give me two last good reps, Last one, rest, okay. Dumbbells by the sides of your mat. We're going a good old fashioned push up. Feet, I mean, sorry, hands close or wide. I don't mind. Let's go. Now, if you can do that push up, keep going. If you're not quite in your push up yet, I want you to practice lowering down, two, three, and then sit back to child's pose and then doing that again, okay? Two, three, sit back. So you're working that phase instead. We're coming to rows. Grab your weight, hips back, squeeze the elbows back and in, and then the arms come straight under the shoulders. Good job, hinge from the hips, elbows high, squeeze those shoulder blades together, keep the shoulders down, the neck in line with the spine. Core on, three, two, one. Come back down. We're back to our push-up. Hands close or wide, or you're working slowly down, pressing back to child. I am on my fists, because I'm working through a wrist issue at the moment. But it's another nice variation that you might want to try. Strengthening those wrists. Let's go, you've got five, four, three, two, one. And if you are up on your toes and not on your knees, you are my hero, okay? Let's go, rows, hinge those hips and breathe. Squeeze slowly lower, squeeze slowly lower. Let's play with that tempo. Squeeze and snap it in, lower with control. Good job, core on, shoulder blades back and down. You've got last one, 
lift the hips, place the weights down, final round of push-ups. Woo! How are you doing? I am with you, I can see you. Let's go, let's finish up strong. We have some ab work coming up next, all right? So those arms are gonna get a good break. <laughs> so let's keep moving, wrapping it out. You've got three, two, one, rest. Okay, final round of rows. Squeeze it in, low with control. In, with control. Hinge it from those hips. Off we go. Woo! Yes. Working that upper back to help you stand strong. Beautiful posture. Standing tall and confident in your life. You've got five, four, three, two, one. Press the hips forward. Come down to seated. Okay. You're gonna have one weight down by your feet, one weight in your hands. Let's start with a Russian twist. We are here for 20 seconds. Stay in control. Keep your elbows wide, your chest open. Tuck the tail, come back lower. Woo! All right, feel those obliques. You've got two, you've got one. Sit up, ankles together, the weight is weighing your feet down. You're gonna come back. We're gonna lift, tap the ankles, lower, lift, lower. Okay, so that weight is helping you to keep those feet down. If you can't come all the way up, come as far as you can. Option to take arms overhead to add a little bit more. Four, three, two, one, and we are back to our Russian twist. Woo, twice through each exercise again. Off we go. Breathe in, come back, curl the spine, dig those heels in, let's go. You can have two weights, you can have one weight, you can drop the weight if you need, but let's keep moving. Five, four, yes, I am proud of you, you are killing it. Last one, come up, wait on top of your ankles. Now, I'm just gonna try this. This could be a disaster, but I might try holding the weight as well. Let's go. Woo! For this round, something different. I'm gonna get my belly to my thighs and then sit all the way back down. You've got eight, seven, six, stay with me. Five, four, three, two, one. How'd you go? Woo! We are in our final round and then we have one last exercise. So, good job. Let's keep moving side to side. Russian twist. Let's get lower. Let's draw that belly back and down. Open your chest. Breathe. Oh my goodness. Ah! I am with you. What are we doing? Three, two, one. Weight on those ankles. I am going no weight in my hands this round. You do you, whatever is best. Off we go, tap and down, or reach past the feet, come down. Keep moving, keep those heels grounded. Yes, my friends, yes, my team, you are killing it today. Five more seconds, get faster. Four, three, two, one. All right, final two exercises, you need one weight. It's like a kettlebell swing, but we're using a dumbbell, so feet around about hip distance apart, elbows stay glued in by your side. You hinge from the hips, swing it back, and then hips press forward. It's like a reaction with your arms, okay? So the whole movement is with your hips. Keep those elbows in, shoulders down. You've got four, three, two, one. This next one can be done with or without your weight. We are doing a jump squat. So you're either using that weight and coming off the ground or you're lifting the heels for no impact, okay? Wherever you are, we are pushing our cardio now with our final just over a minute to go. Oh my goodness. Squeezing out any last bit of juice that we've got for this workout for today. Two, one, 
Oh my gosh, quads on fire. Reset, shoulders down. That dumbbell swings just in between the legs. Hinge from the hips. Let's go. So, this movement is from your hips, not from your knees like a squat, okay? Upper body stays strong. <sighs> Exhale to press forward. The arms are just a reaction from the legs, from the lower body. Oh my gosh, no. I can't do it again. Oh my gosh, okay. Squat jump, drop the weight if you need, all right? Three, two, one. Listen to your body always. Whew. Let's go. But I'm going to push through today. I'm determined because I am with any of you who are doing it too. We have five more seconds. Four, all the way to the end. Two, one. Whew. Okay, final round. This is killer. What are we doing? We're getting strong. We are awesome. Swing it back. Press those hips forward. Good job. Oh my goodness. That core is on. Upper body strong. Hinging from those hips. Swing, swing, swing. You've got three, two. Give me last one. Whew. Final round. So again, you're getting lift off with those feet or you're just rising up onto your toes. Let's go. Last 20 seconds. Be smart. Drop weight if you need. Otherwise, if you're feeling like you've got it, you've got less than 10 seconds. We've got five, four, three, ah, two, one. Oh my God. That last one I nearly fell over. Give yourself a huge clap. Whew, 21 minutes. Come down, take a seat. I've left a cool down stretch. It's five minutes in the description box below. So take that definitely. Have some water, eat lots of healthy food, nourish your body. Let me know how you went today in the comments below. And if you enjoyed, please remember to hit like, to share, and most importantly, subscribe. It just really helps my channel to grow and for me to reach more people like you who would benefit from these workouts. So stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy, stretch, nourish your body, and I can't wait to see you again soon. Bye-bye.